Hello, the purpose of this video is to instruct you in the use of the handheld multimeters that we use at the college. They are used to measure resistance, volts DC, volts AC, AC current and DC current. In almost all cases you will use the handheld multimeter to measure resistance and volts DC occasionally volts AC. You need to make sure the probes are as shown here, volts and common, and you can adjust the range using the dial as I'm showing you there. You switch the meter on here. When you see a 1 there, that means it's out of range, it's not taking a reading. The first thing I'm going to do is a continuity test where I touch the, both probes together and we see a reading of 0 0.6 ohms which means that's the continuity of the probes that's their resistance it means they're working just fine typically that would be the first check you would do using a multimeter to make sure it's working now I'm measuring the resistance of a resistor in this case it's a 10k resistor and I've wrapped it between both probes there we see that the reading is out of range so adjust the dial upwards until you get a reading and based on that particular range, we have 9.86 kilo ohms, that's 9,860 ohms, which taken into account the tolerance of a resistor is just fine. Now we're going to be measuring the voltage of the power supply. It's the same deal really, I'm starting at 200 millivolts range, just to show you that when you put the probes onto the terminals, you don't get a reading, as we can see. Once again, we move upwards, until you get a reading this time you're getting 5.94 volts and you can see that that is quite a bit different to what the power supply is telling us that happens quite often with power supplies it's very important that you check the voltage to make sure that it agrees with what you expect it to be if you want to measure current this probe must go into either this socket or this socket the common probe stays where it is and you use the current range it's very important you select the correct parameter for that which you are trying to measure. Hope this has been helpful. Goodbye and good luck. 